So talk about being in this environment, all these people, all these coaches, all these great teams. What's the intensity like here? Yeah, I mean, it's great here because um, every game you play is like day three of a qualifier. And I think we kind of talked about that all year. Like those day three games where you're going three and extra points, those like prepare you for this. And it's great just to be with so many players who like have the same drive as you um, and just really care about winning. Well, and you can, hear the, you can feel the intensity in here on day one. You just imagine what tournament day is going to be like at the end of the week. So you guys start out 2-0. and You guys play a national schedule all year. What's it like playing against the best players in the country all year, every year with Circle City? Yeah, I mean, I feel like it's really prepared me for the college game. Right. Obviously, you play against these girls, and you know where some of them are going. You know they're power five players. And I think it's important to like get practice against those people and I mean we even have them in our own gym and that really helps like every practice you know we're playing against the best. We play against our older teams, alumni, coaches, so then we come in here and it's kind of just like another day. Um, I mean obviously it's an intense another day. Right. <laughs> so let's talk about that great lead in. You talk about it prepares you for the college game. Right. Let's talk a little bit about you know as one of the top prospects in the 2025 class What's your recruiting journey been like so far? Yeah, so it's been pretty stressful. Um, almost immediately though, I kind of narrowed down to like 15 schools and then uh, now I'm down to five. Um, and so I really want to take my time and find like the right fit. So I'm definitely going to take my visits in August, um, maybe early September, and then I'll plan on being committed by the end of September. Yeah, I was going to say like, what's going to be important to you on those visits like what will be some determining factors for you finding that fit yeah um i really care about like coaching staff you know do i get along with them as people like they're coaches but they're also your family and when you're going away from home you need to like be with people who really care about you and then also like i'm looking forward to interacting with the players and kind of seeing if we have the same mindset um if we value the same things should we ask like does location matter at all for you yeah, um, not really. Honestly, most high schools are pretty close to home just because I yep. wanted to play, you know, in a big conference. Right. And this is like the home of big volleyball. Yeah, well, where you live isn't a bad spot for volleyball. Yeah. So, uh, so we talk all the time, athletes talk about having, being defined as more than just a volleyball player. Right. So what's something you can tell us about Reese? What are you that's a lot more than a volleyball player? So I'd say one thing that kind of sets me apart is I'm really big like in the academics. So like I have like eight APs and um, I mean I'm in the top 20 of my class. I've taken the SAT like five times. Like I, I really just care about that. Yeah. Um, so I definitely want to go somewhere where I'm getting you know a good degree that's kind of made all this work worth it. Awesome. Thank you so much. Good luck the rest of the.